Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you how to create a clean, professional CV or resume in Figma, and the best part is you won't have to start from scratch. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know exactly how to find and customize a free template in Figma, giving you a polished CV ready to send out for your next big opportunity, all without the headache of building every element by hand. To start, we're going to take advantage of Figma's templates and built-in tools. Think of it this way, building a resume from a template is like using the frame of a house, so you can focus on decorating and making it your own instead of worrying about the foundation. It's a huge time saver and trust me, your final product will look just as unique. So let's dive in first up, open Figma. If you don't already have a Figma account, it's free to get started, just sign up and you're good to go. Once you're in, look for the option to browse templates and tools. This is your shortcut to a library of ready-made designs created by other talented folks. In the search bar, type in CV or resume. You'll see a whole list of designs pop up, from sleek and modern to more formal, traditional layouts. Take a moment to scroll through and select a design that feels like a good fit for you. There's no one-size-fits, all here, so pick something that matches both your industry and your personality a little bit. For instance, if you're in a creative field, maybe go for something more bold or colorful. Or if you're applying for a corporate position, a minimalist clean design might make the right impression. Once you've chosen a template you like, just click Open in Figma. This brings the template into your editor, ready for you to customize. And here, where the real fun begins, all the text, icons, and colors can be edited. Click on the placeholders to add your name, contact info, work experience, and so on. Don't worry if you're not a designer, Figma's interface is really intuitive. If you can use drag and drop, you can definitely do this. If you want, you can take it a step further by copying and pasting elements from the template into your own design file. That way you can mix and match layouts or tweak things even more to reflect your style. Maybe you want to swap out a color, change a header font, add an icon, or even insert a section for portfolio work. It's all possible and because you started with a template, you already have that professional structure in place. Remember, the key here is making it your own. Personalize the wording, make sure your achievements stand out, and don't be afraid to adjust spacing or alignment so everything looks neat and balanced. Take a few extra minutes to proofread and polish your CV, those finishing touches really do make a difference. And that's it. Now you know how to quickly build a standout CV or resume in Figma, using all the tools and templates at your disposal. I hope this saves you tons of time and sets you up for success in your job search. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you have any questions or want to share your own Figma CV tips, drop a comment below. I love hearing from you. Don't forget to subscribe for more easy-to-follow design tutorials. Thanks for watching and see you next time.